our community is a great community. And I feel that I'm excited with the opportunity to get to serve this community more and would support you, would appreciate your support in that. But I would also be supporting the community back because the only reason that I would be on city council is to serve you. And I would ask for your vote. Well, you folks know that I already do serve you. I serve the community with our nonprofit organization called Stepping On Up. In 21 months, we've provided over 4,500 pairs of shoes to those in need right here in the city. I'm at the MANA meetings. I'm at RNP. I'm at the city council meetings. I'm a neighborhood watch captain. So I'm totally involved with the community and trying to know anybody and everybody that's in my area. So I will continue that as your council representative. And if you ever have a question about anything, no matter what it is, come knock on the door. I'll be there. Well, we're all good people up here sending money to serve. We really are. Um, but what I, we're all really doing is applying for a job. Uh, we're asking you to vote for us, and by voting for us, we're asking you to hire us. And with that, I'd ask you to look at my resume. My resume is pretty thick. I've had the budget experience, I've had the personnel issues, I've had the crisis uh, the, uh, solving problems, and I've been a proven leader. I also am very involved in this community. You can look at the organizations I'm involved in, from Safe House to Rape Crisis to Kiwanis to RCCD Foundation. So I've got a lot of strengths in, in the community. And I look at this as another way to serve. And also, when you apply for a job, you bring references. And the business community knows I'm strong in business, and that's why they, I have the endorsement of the Chamber of Commerce. I've been endorsed by the Press Enterprise. I have the endorsement of Sheriff Stan Sniff within our law enforcement community. Uh, and I have the, the endorsement of retired Mayor Love, Ron Leverage and retired uh, District Attorney Grover Tass. So if you could, hire me by voting for me. Thank you. Well, I'd like to thank you all for coming tonight. It's been a long evening, and I know that we've all enjoyed the questioning, at least I have, and I'll talk to you as long as you wish afterward. And again, that cell phone number is 951-515-1663. Call me. I want to serve you. I have no agenda other than your agenda. You know, I don't, I'm not here for a title, and I'm not here for a position. I'm here to move Riverside forward and make it a better place. And to answer your question a little bit earlier on the weaknesses, it's our business issues, traffic, and our aging infrastructure. I wanted to get that in. That's important. I didn't want to miss out on that. So I just want to let you know that, you know, this, this is about making Riverside a far better place than it is. We have an awesome city, but we need to work on it. We need to stay on it, and we need to have the infrastructure there to pay the bills. That's, that's very, very important. So I'm looking for your support. I'm looking for you to partner with me. I want to work with you. I want to listen to you. And I want to take your voice to City Hall. Remember, when I'm elected, I do not work for City Hall. I work for you and everybody in Ward 3. And thank you very much. Let's give these candidates a big round of applause. Please.